If you're searching for Ultimate Team Coins, head over to ifootcoins.com, hit up the link in the description below, and use my discount code GUNA for 6% off. What's up guys, Guinness here bringing you another Inform player review, and today we are reviewing second Inform Santi Cozzola, yes the Spanish midfielder who plays for Arsenal. Now there's the squad that I played him in, got him as a cam in a 4-1-2-1-2, and guys remember 200 likes would be amazing, make sure you follow me on Twitter as well, I've added the Hawk chemistry style to him to boost his pace, shooting and his physical. So 5 foot 6, medium medium work rates, right footed, 5 star weak foot, 4 star skill moves as well. Cost me 340k but his price is dropping, 7 games, 9 goals and 2 assists isn't a bad return at all. So how to compare to his regular card? Well this is second in form, he's changed from a left mid to a centre mid, that is a big deal. Then you've got his pace going up by 3, dribbling and physical by 4, shooting and passing by 5 and defending seeing the biggest increase going up by 7 overall. And you can see that by the impact it has on his in-game stats. You can see his strength has now gone up to 63 which is much better than it was before. You can see 95 balance as well, vision 90, you know he's got stats in the dark greens. And again look at the skill attributes, pretty much all of them are dark green apart from the ones for defending, that's absolutely outstanding. Shot power's gone up to 83 as well, short pass at 91, 87 long shots, that is key and you'll see that in the video. Can play as a left mid, cam or right mid, weighs 145 pounds as well, that's not too bad at all. And you can see there, look at how the balance of him, it's all about the passing, dribbling and shooting. You can see he's got some extra specialities right there. He's now got so many, he's fully stacked, and he's got more than even his original inform card had. So what were my expectations of this card? Well, you know, I love this first inform and get it a nine out of 10. And this card is so much better. 100% like massive improvement in terms of what it was. And you'll see from this goal, how outstanding this guy is. Absolutely world-class finish there. You know, the nice spin coming into the like dipping long shot, left the keeper for dead. You'll see here the goalkeeper like it almost buckles his knee. He just turns around and you know what, he's not going to be happy in the morning. This guy's an absolute pleasure and it's amazing that he is central. Don't waste time playing him at centre mid, you're going to get bullied because he's not the strongest guy. He is noticeably stronger than his first in form as well and even his regular card. However, it's just not about playing him in centre mid. Play him at cam or third forward at centre forward and that's where you'll get the best out of him. You know, the four star skills, the five star weak foot, absolutely outstanding. That agility, balance, shot power. You name it, this guy's absolutely amazing. I can't rave highly enough about him. He's absolutely outstanding at cam and he'll not let you down. You know, it's just like he's like almost the ball's glued to his feet. And you know what? His pace isn't that bad as well. He's got enough pace when you need it to get you out of trouble as well. It's just so easy to play with him. I enjoyed every moment that I played with this guy. He won't let you down. I mean, he's not going to be the tallest guy and he's not the strongest overall, but it's a big improvement from where he was. So definitely I would say go try him out and I think if he drops to around 200k I'd say go pick him up and I don't think he'll let you down at all because he definitely didn't let me down so card I'd recommend. So let's review overall what I thought about him. Position change to centre mid is a big deal and that makes him so much more outstanding than being on the left hand side. Agility and dribbling absolutely amazing. Unreal long shots guys. Just look at the one that I scored. Absolutely amazing. 5 star weak foot, 4 star skill as well, just great stuff for him and you know what, I feel the strength increase as well from his other cards. The only thing that you can say about this guy is not the tallest, so it's not going to win much in the air but overall give him a 9.25 out of 10, he is getting there. I guess the only way to improve now is if he probably gets another inform or if he gets a team in the season. So that's the review guys, hopefully you enjoyed it, if you did leave a like below, comment subscribe and as always thanks for watching.